A Logan County family speaking out after they say their eighth grade son's First Amendment rights were violated. 13 News' Charlotte Green has the latest. And she said, are you supposed to wear that in school? I said, I don't see why I shouldn't. When eighth grade Jared Markham got dressed for school Thursday morning, he says he had no idea that his pro Second Amendment shirt would initiate what he calls a fight over his First Amendment rights. I never knew, I never thought it would go this far because Honestly, I don't see a problem with this. There shouldn't be a problem with this. It was this gun, or actually the image of this gun, printed on Jared's T-shirt that sparked a dispute between a Logan Middle School teacher and Jared that ended with Jared suspended, arrested, and facing two charges on his otherwise spotless record. Because I would not take my shirt off because I believe that I should have a right to wear this. I don't believe there's anything wrong with this shirt. The rage still kind of grew as you get more into the subject matter. Jared's father, Alan Lardieri, says he's angry he had to rush from work to pick his son up from jail over something he says was blown way out of proportion. I mean, I don't see how anybody would have an issue with a hunting rifle in NRA put on the front of a t-shirt, especially when policy doesn't forbid it. I have here a copy of the Logan County School District's dress code policy, and while it prohibits clothing that displays profanity, violence, discriminatory messages, nowhere on this document doesn't mention anything about gun images. I reached out to officials at Logan Middle and with the school district. So far, I haven't heard anything back. Charlo Green, 13 News, working for you. And Logan City Police did confirm that Jared had been arrested and charged today. Again, 13 News tried contacting the Logan County School District, but have not heard anything back. We certainly will follow up on this story first thing tomorrow morning.